Hello, 10th graders, it's Mrs. Dukoski. You found me reading my Shakespearean sonnets. Today is Shakespeare's birthday. All good English teachers are reading some Shakespeare today. I have sonnet 98 for you. And we know sonnets are 14 line poems. These are Shakespearean sonnets or English sonnets. We'll talk more about that in a couple of weeks when we start reading some more Shakespeare. Spoiler alert. Sonnet 98. From you have I been absent in the spring, when proud pied April, dressed in all his trim, hath put a spirit of youth in everything, that heavy Saturn laughed and left with him. Yet nor the lays of birds, nor the sweet smell of different flowers in odor, and in hue, could make me any summer story tell, or from their proud lap pluck them where they grew. Nor did I wonder at the lily's white, nor praise the deep vermilion in the rose. They were but sweet, but figures of delight. Drawn after you, you pattern of all those, yet seemed it winter still, and you away, as with your shadow, I with these did play. That's your Shakespeare for today. And did we talk about the fun fact that Shakespeare was born on April 23rd? So that's pr the day that he was baptized. That's how they kept records for a very long time, not the birthday. And he died on that same day, years later. So birth date and death date, April 23rd, William Shakespeare, who may or may not have written all of these works attributed to him. But again, we'll talk about that in a few weeks. So right now, what we're going to talk about is your World War II book choice. So a lot of you are reading night. That's what we would have been reading in class together. We may have even done night in, in one day. So maybe this is your choice. Or you're reading Man's Search for Meaning by Viktor Frankl. Excellent choice. Or you've chosen your own World War II reading book. So whatever you're reading, this is week one. You have three weeks to finish it. So break your book into thirds. And then each week you'll get questions to answer. So the questions for the week, there's five of them are already posted on Schoology. So go in and answer those questions and try to keep, even if you've read ahead, um, try to keep your answers to this first set of questions based on that first third of your book. So the, you know, based on the be more the beginning of your story. And then we'll talk more the middle of your story next week. So message me if you have any questions. I miss you so much and I'll hopefully see you sooner than later. Bye.